the latest 3.24 PTU patch has been through really crazy ups and downs. And there are some major changes in this PTU patch, so let's take a look at them together. First of all, there is an item bank UI change. Based on feedbacks, we determined the storage access flow was not providing the results we wanted. We've thus changed it to open a filtered view of the warehouse inventory to only show FPS gear like the storage access kiosk did. Search is missing in that view and will be added in a future patch. Alright, storage access change. So let's check it out. If we touch to start. So basically, when you are using the storage access, it's like you are pressing I to access the local storage like the previous patches. Right now, you just have to hit F, open the storage access. Now, you have everything here. We just don't have a search bar, but uh, CIG said they're going to add it in the later patches. And look at the, the thumbnails. It's been reduced. I'm using a 4K display. So let me see if I can drag. Yes, I can drag items in and I, I can just equip directly from this um, local inventory when you open the access storage. This is not as convenient as the previous patches. You can just press I, open your local inventory anywhere you want. But this is a much better compromise than what we had when PTU just started. So CIG did listen to us. They did a little compromise here. This is a very, very good sign. This is good. Let's check uh, closing. Yep. Weapon. Oh, finally. One page. We can see so many weapons. It's much easier for us to choose. This is a good change for the item bank from the storage access. Now, let's go check out the freight elevator. Oh, here we, we still don't have the ideal thumbnail display. I don't think there's any change here in the freight elevator. Yeah, the thumbnail is pretty big. Second big change is regarding the tractor beam. Tractor beam use adjustments. Tractor beam use on the multi-tool has had its cargo mass balanced to restrict use to cargo size under 32 SEU. So the multi-tool can no longer move 32 SEU crates and to reduce usable distance. Both handheld tractor beams have had their movement speed reduced. So basically three things. We cannot tractor 32 SU crates or bigger with our tractor beams and the tractoring distance has been reduced and the movement speed has been reduced even further. So let's check this out. So tractoring distance has been lowered. Let me see how far can this go. Oh, range warning. 20, 22 meters. That's it. 22, above 22, got a range warning. You can go a little bit more and then it will drop. And for the tractoring speed, this is a very small box. It's hard to tell. So let's go actually take a ship out and do a cargo mission while testing the tractor beams. The cargo mission also has a change. Cargo hauling mission change greatly increased cargo hauling mission rewards, allowed players to retrieve cargo for shared missions where they aren't the original mission owner, set hauling intro mission to not be shareable. So, the hauling mission, oh, I can see, greatly increased the reward for hauling mission. Before, the beginning hauling mission pays 4k, right now, it pays 13k, 13,750, just for the entry level hauling mission. But the first hauling mission, we cannot share. You don't see a share button. But after this, we can share every single hauling mission. And the party member can also access the storage place, which is good. So someone in the party can start pulling the crates and the other party member can get ready the ship. But of course, you will have to share the rewards. Alright. Landing. Landing complete. Oh, now in third person, I just see my ship. I think uh, the parallel universe bug in the hangar is also fixed. 
Okay, now this is the elevator here. Let's get the cargos. Oh, this is this is bad. You see, uh, I think before when I stand on my ship right here, I can tractor the box. Right now the distance has been shortened. I cannot just stand on my ship and tractor the box. Well, I have to go, well, quite close. You can see quite, there we go. Quite close just to tractor this box. Now let's try the max lift. Oh, this one has longer distance. Oh, this one has much longer range. Let's see how far this can go. Oh, range warning right there. 82 meters. Four times of that of the handheld track beam, the range. Yes, the max lift is the way to go. But I think the small track beam, track this, you can see it move move a little bit faster huh maybe just a little bit faster the tractor gun I think might be the same actually maybe a little bit slower but the uh, distance is quite long 82 meters for the max lift Small tractor beam is 22 meters. So with the max lift, you can tractor the box directly from the cargo elevator. But when you scroll your mouth wheel to bring the box to you, the movement is really slow. All right, now let's test the tractor beams with different sizes of the SEU box. So this is a uh, size one. I will try the small tractor beam first. So the distance is 22 meters. Let's try this big one here. Yes, 22 meters. Try the max lift. 80... 84 meters, actually. 84 meters for the one SCU box. Speed for the box to come back. Much slower than before. 8 SU box. Yeah, 84 meters. Max lift. Okay, so last test we're gonna do about the uh, tractor beams are these. The patch note says we cannot tractor 32 SU box. But does that mean only the handheld tractor beam or the max lift as well? So let's find out. First of all, let's use the small tractor beam. Oh, we still can tractor this. Oh, we can snap to it, but we cannot drag it. It's not enough force to drag it. Let me see this. This I can tractor. Oh, you know what? The heavier the boxes are, the closer the distance. The small boxes I tested, 22 meters. This one... Wow, this is crazy. This is only like 15 meters range warning. Yeah, 14, 15 meters, 15 meters for this, uh, I think it's 16 SU. Yes, 16 SU box. Now let me try the max lift. 16 SU max lift. Oh. 71 meters. 71 meters for the max lift for the 16 ICU. It really depends on the weight, I think. This is 15.5 tons. Okay, now let's try the 32 ICU. This is 31 tons. Oh, we can move the 32 ICU with max lift. How far can we tractor it oh f range warning mass exceeded 59 59 meters before 60 meters let's say 60 meters is a maximum range for the 32 SCU box commodity box with the max lift well good to know that uh, it's only the small tractor beam that cannot tractor the 32 SCU 
So the max lift is indeed the way to go. Okay, so the, these are 24 ICU. 24 ICU. Let's check the small tractor beam. Yes, the small tractor beam can still work on the 24 ICU. This is 23.2 tons. Let's see the distance. It's only about, I think, a little bit over 10 meters. Yes, 11 meters. It's all you get. 11 meters. It will drop. So this uh, small tractor beam is not good for working for these big boxes. Okay, let's try the tractor gun. Sixty-one meters is as far as we can go for the twenty-four ICU boxes. Sixty-four meters. Okay, now let's try the sixteen ICU. Let me try to rotate it. Oh, the rotating speed for the sixteen ICU is very slow. Rotate this way. Quite slow. 32 SEU. Try to rotate. It was slower before. It's even slower now. The rotating speed. So the weight does affect how far you can tractor or how fast you can rotate or drag those boxes. So this is uh, 24 ICU. The rotating speed. A little faster. Okay, so this is it for the major changes for the new 3.24 patch. Especially, especially the tractor beam change. I've tested as much as I can think of. So if I'm missing anything, please let me know. So the conclusion is the max lift is the way to go from now on with this change and the small tractor beam just for some small fps items all right guys thanks for watching i will see you in the next one